Okay, a simple run of the generator. There we are with the HV output. It's now mounted on, uh, well, it's actually part of a PC monitor. Uh, it's the big ferrite round thing <laughs> which goes on the tube. There's the whole sensor now set to trigger, collapse the coil. The LED shows that it's triggering and there's the HV output again. Now I've got to work on tidying things up in the next stage of the circuit. Right, uh, very messy now and not the best of experiments but there we've got the Windsor Tower with the coil inside which is that one and uh, well, let's see now. Wire coming in, wire going out, going to the plus. Uh, two little diodes to split the power that goes to the inner coil. And we do get a very, very, very mild, very, very mild <laughs> wireless field. But it's not anything spectacular yet. So I mean, I show. I suppose it does show that this kind of thing does produce wireless, wireless energies. But there's a long way to go with it. Right. While I was doing that, when I finished the other part of this video, um, I thought I might as well try the neon. And this isn't too bad though. Uh, well, give me a second. If I have the one wire coming out the top from the tower and hold the other leg the neon just starts to barely come on but I guess that means that the energies are transferring wirelessly to the neon which still partly lights um, so it's all a bit interesting Okay, the weirdest of phenomena. As you can see, the LED just comes on very slightly. Not much range as before. But, we've got no primary. I've connected the, uh, the first wire, the bottom part of the tower, to the trigger from the hall sensor. Which also goes to, uh, the other side of which, sorry, of the coil goes to the neon, which is lit and its other leg goes to the very top of the tower and as I say it produces the very weird phenomenon when it does it of the LED partially lighting there very bizarre And finally, check this out. There's the neon, unlit. There's the wire going in and out. If I hold that, the neon, and I touch with the other finger, the neon comes on. There's quite a kick of HV to this. But as you can see, if I hold the thing tighter, then the bulb goes brighter. And as I say, there's quite a tingle through the fingers of uh, HV going on. Yeah, I like that. Well, not the tingling. <laughs>